Hi there guys, good evening from Dhaka, Bangladesh. Time in Dhaka is around 9.39 p.m. and I'm going to be doing uh, initial impression or you can say first review on a fragrance from this house of Rehan uh, from UAE. It's a sub-brand of Rasasi and this fragrance is called Fresh Way for him and this is part of their Aqua or Aqua collection. So previously you have seen me doing initial impression on these two bad boys, Ocean Rush and Pacific and i will uh, talk about them again you know because these three are part of one collection and i think these are the three they uh, have if they release some more in future i don't know so i am you know accompanied by my arbrati i have a little bit of a <coughs> cold mm. so to get the voice going i'll be sitting on my tea so this house this is gonna be my fifth review and there are not that many reviews on net because this is relatively a new house okay new house means uh, one year or so they have come out and uh, to give you a short uh, introduction this house belongs to uh, original pen companies rasasi owner of this brand is mr khalid mr khalid is son of owner of rasasi and this rehan is the name of his son uh, so he named his uh, brand uh, you know like following his son's name so the, i just wanted to mention this you know i remember not saying it in previous reviews um like Rehan, I think, was a character from this movie called Fana. You know, if you happen to be from India, happen to be from India or Pakistan or Bangladesh, you know that movie of American, very popular movie called Fana. Fana was a great film, great film with great music and power cast like uh, Kajol and Amir Khan. So later on, their son was called Rehan, and there was a song called Tere ha Mere Hat Me Tere Tera Hat Hai. You know that that song. Mere hat me, tera hat ho. You know that song yes i can't sing sing that well but uh, if you know the song so this mo uh, movie you know this perfume reminds me of that name rehan uh, who was the son of amir khan kajo so let's get into the fragrance review and uh, this one i bought uh, recently from a house called fragrantica bangladesh from a shop which is uh, the first one very first one in bangladesh to bring this house and this is going to be the next hype of the house like just like latafa fragrance world rasa c arma so on and so forth and this is part of the aqua collection all three uh, so i just want to leave the review out there for those who ask okay so this one the third one is very interesting as well the first one ocean rush was done by alberto morias this one i don't know uh, other two i don't know if they did it uh, with the same perfumer but part of the same line but i said in my review i loved pacific more than ocean rush so third one let's see if i like it as much as the previous two or it's just okay so a uh, little bit long intro but i want to say everything i want to say this is my style of reviewing so the thing is uh the packaging is very beautiful blue these are aqua marine <clears throat> that's kind of a even like a themed summer fragrance summer slash spring for people who love blue uh, fresh you know bright sunny days kind of fragrance maybe in somewhere in dubai or philippines you know malaysia singapore indonesia vietnam cambodia bangladesh pakistan these kind of areas was very hot even in africa many countries you could use some soothing fragrance these are soothing perfumes okay and uh bottle presentation pricing is phenomenal uh, for the price you get absolute value for time being they are being sold under 25 bucks and i think in future this is gonna price gonna go up because of the inflation and dollar rate and all that so let's go uh price on these are under 25 dollars as i mentioned for 100 mil edp beautiful packaging on these i must give it to them they did very beautiful design so like that you have seen the previous too, you would know this box is similar but the color is a little bit different on each bottle they are distinctive in their own ways so the batch code and all that 2013 it's good sorry 2023 till 2027 very good and here i mentioned always they have this cut on the box it says rehan uh, in bangladesh you would say raihan because uh, that's our typical names so you can just open it like that you don't really have to do dig your nose and then try to pick up which can be very painful so the bottle is very beautiful just like the previous two if you keep it like this <clears throat> actually they are not really same okay uh, i'll show you one has silver cap the one fresh wave today the previous one was ocean rush was the white cap at the back it was white paint and this is gold the pacific pacific look like this golden golden bob uh, back golden writing and cap the ocean fresh had this most beautiful bottle with the white and blue that's my personal favorite the third one here is called rehan fresh wave for him this one is silver <coughs> front and back is kind of like you can say light blue or something colored it's not same as previous ones okay so even the same bottle design and color is almost same just these are the differences chromish cap these are plastic caps not very heavy but okay uh, has 
good grip on them so you can pick it up no problem no loose grips doesn't click onto place atomizer is very very good i'm wearing this fragrance here on my right hand let me spray this and the sprayer once again i showed you all this bottle spray amazing really really good sprayer <coughs> effortless sprayer uh, you will not have any issue with these sprayers sometimes you get that from <coughs> sorry 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 <coughs> the voice sometimes you get that from a cheap budget house like paris corner sometimes sometimes i notice not just paris corner sometimes some houses uh, even armaf there you know uh, sprayers get stuck you know sometimes don't work the juice distribution is not so good these are really good so i give them props price is very good bottle presentation very nice sprayer is good so now let's talk about it this perfume after almost six minutes is a dupe of a very popular fragrance called green eyes to it by uh, creed which happens to be one of the more popular fragrance in uh, fragrances in usa per se but i never really found green eyes to it to be my most favorite something about it because the grassy vetiver lemon verbena you know, that combination is kind of for me you know a little weird you know it's like a little bit dated and uh, not really suitable for our country because it got some to my nose some iris violet leaves ambergris sandalwood and at some point i felt <clears throat> there was a little bit of a lavender so that fragrance is aromatic uh, kind of like a sharp perfume uh, with decent longevity good fragrance for spring and autumn uh, summer some people wear it but mm, i personally prefer a fragrance called cool water okay which is the closest thing to that and i just love that perfume a lot so this fragrance is a dupe of uh, that git greenish to it slash cool water funny fact about cool water and greenish to it they were released like three years apart the original greenish to it was released in 1983 let me check uh, fragrantica it was released in 1985 five, right and joint perfumers were olivier creed and pierre bourdon so the funny thing is three years after greenish to it was launched they released from davidoff uh, cool water which was released in 1988 so seven years after i was born and same perfumer so there were differences in notes breakdown i'm not going to go deep into that but i just tell you one thing there were many many dupes of green eyes to it let me show you some of them in the past they're not the same they have their differences like aspen by Coty. i'm going to go in depth so you can understand uh, this review aspen by Coty, and uh, this is a very affordable perfume i need to get it back up very very nice kind of like a you know pine tree kind of smell with that cool water vibe then i did back then train we uh, this one is from armaf and they also did tray bond that was a bit weird but this is very close to cool water people say that was one of the best uh, clones of git then i think they released something like le parfait by armaf same company and this was something similar to aventus slash greenish tweet after that I think uh, there were some other fragrances like I did review uh, Rasas is Egra. I don't have that anymore. Then I did uh, Lavenshire Night by Al Haramein. I used to have that sold it off. And I think uh, the Bond number no. nine niche perfume uh, was called Shea Bond or Shea's Bond. I forgot the name exactly. That fragrance was similar to uh, Green Eyes to it. But I find the most uh, like upgraded version of even better version of GIT is. That name egg waste in my humble opinion i did this review four or five years back i said it back then i find this more up close version of mont blanc legend and git this is the goat goat then uh, that is a different fragrance altogether but the closest until now i said this one al harame etoa uh, etoilis this fragrance is the closest thing next to uh, maybe um greenish tree and cool water which is the best this is a beast mode version of cool water that one so far is my most favorite this one is interesting okay rehan what they did the owner told me uh joy by uh, brother this fragrance is maybe something very simple you may not like it he sent me these two right but i bought this one uh with my own money because i wanted to finish the line fresh wave is a very cool name cool water and fresh wave you can see they go side by side right and uh this is definitely very close to cool water on dry down but the opening is magic when i sprayed it for the first time i don't have a nose breakdown but let me do once more i'll tell you why this is special going double shots and this is my most favorite in the line i always tell you when you spray on your arm let the water disappear and then sniff it in the meantime i'll tell you out of the three this is my most favorite any day okay the pacific was something similar to invictus and i said it's more invictus aqua like and Ocean Rush is a mix of some fragrances, but it has ambergris. You can say uh, Creed Zero Alpha style perfume, okay, or Tom Ford um, 
was the fragrance. There was a fragrance, uh, Tom Ford, uh, man, Neroli, Portofino line, that kind of fragrance, but it's, it has its own character. But this one right here is the ultimate king out of this three for summer. Why? The opening of this stuff is magical, magical. And I say it with the most commitment because so far out of the three, this is the opening I love the most. Everybody have the different choices. Someone like this, someone like this, someone like that. But I'll tell you one thing, the opening wise is just so, so ahead of the other two. Okay. The opening has the rosemary mint, you know, something cooling. You have seen my review on Rasasi Hawa's eyes. This one is not like Hawa size, but it has that mint cooling, sort of like a citrus, and the rosemary kick is so beautiful, herbaceous, cool, metallic, you know, and definitely it's more modern version of cool water in the opening. Definitely, I would say <clears throat> even nicer than Etowa, which I love a lot. So that is the first magic of this perfume. The opening is 10 out of 10, 10, no doubt about it. If you spray this, you'll you'll smile and you'll say yes this is for summer this is for the sunny days blue skies and i'm going to be wearing white shirt i'm going to rock this wherever i rock aqua di Gio, light blue by dolce and gabbana sabosh this i can wear and this smells like this dior chanel like mainstream designer perfumes which are hundred dollars worth right so this is 25 you know if you can find it cheaper i don't know in dubai maybe 15 dollars or so but if you pay even 35 dollars this is very cheap for that price okay because of the quality so the opening gets 10 presentation price everything gets 10 as it develops it starts showing more of its true nature which is cool water at that point i can see it it's like a little bit uh yeah it's a little bit like a fresher take on cool water but it gets like a peppery kick the pepper i think is uh, joined by maybe green notes um perhaps i don't know um there is this hint of something like spice and that spice i don't know where it comes from maybe something herbaceous or the ambergris and also definitely the rosemary so fresh lemon okay fresh lemon lemon verbena the definitely that cooling metallic tone and i think there is this uh rosemary kick the mint these are the notes and then followed by lavender perhaps to my nose so at that point the seawater vibe it comes like it reminds me of bulgari aqua purum you know jack cavalier's masterpiece if you are familiar with those perfumes, this is going to be right up your alley. Uh, this is cheaper than cool water now by $10, $15. At that price point, I think it's a no-brainer. You can pick it up. I know many people love this fragrance, even till day. Many people love it because they can afford it. I just love the DNA of this. I just love the DNA of it. Do not get me wrong. I love cool water. This is like perfect weekend scent. And it just smells so beautiful, no doubt. But it smells a little bit like a mature version of this. This is more youthful. This could be a crowd pleaser. All three fragrances can be crowd pleaser used by any age range. Okay. So try this one out. Try a sample. Go to the shop or wherever they have it as tester. Try it on your skin. You don't have to follow what I say. I'm just going to wait for some of the reviewers to drop their review. But I, I think this is going to be one of their top sellers, if not the top seller. Okay. But uh, overall, the house, I do love another fragrance more the most uh, love that i did yesterday was this perfume corium for him i ordered the aventus clone let's see how that one is but so far this one my uh, verdict i think this one i gave 8.5 i think this one i gave 8 this one is a 9 out of 10 very good value for money very beautiful bottle and you can fall in love with this perfume because it's very familiar with the previous ones i showed you thank you so much for watching check it out rehan fresh wave a very beautiful take on platinum amigo is like opening followed by cool water and then green eyes to it on the dry down. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. See you soon. Bye-bye.